Hi. Today, the entire world know that India is moving very fast to provide IT-enabled services. And one of the most important domain in this sector is print and digital publishing services. Because of huge volume and the long-term continuation of business. The giant clients in these sectors are many more, as like as Alzheimer's Science, Sleeping Court, Blackwell, SPI, Cambridge University Press, Oxford University Press, Macmillan, Bluesom, John Valley, and many more. Pearson, this type of clients are many more. Those international clients are providing huge volume of jobs in Indian market. But it doesn't mean everyone getting those jobs because there are some basic parameters to get international jobs in this sector. Today I am going to discuss one of the important things which yourself which will keep you in the business for a long time and those important things are related to paginations. One is auto paginations and other is digital fixed layout paginations. So let's discuss about uh, um, auto paginations. Friends, there are two many important things. Uh, those are one is XML and another is InDesign template creations. So I'm just directly going to the project file and just open my project folder. And there are two uh, files over here, template and XML file. And my uh, image folder is there. So just open the template file first. Here is my template file. So the main uh, technique of uh, auto pagination is uh, your template file is created according to your XML file. Whatever the XML elements are appearing in your XML file, uh, you have to create those uh, um, related boxes. Just see this box. I'm just open the XML over here. And see this box. I'm, when I click in this box, it's get highlighted. When I click in this box, it's get highlighted. That means this box is tagged with those XML element. <coughs> see this one so uh, in in this uh, um, tagging you will, you will get the uh, appropriate data in appropriate box so uh, just op open the XML over here I'm just opening my XML file and just open any XML editor and here is the XML file over here you can see the uh, tags in the XML file so you have to know uh, understand the tags and uh, the elements and uh, it will be better for you that you can modify the XML according to your InDesign templates uh, so uh, see uh, here are the XML uh, takings and one more important thing is you can see uh, just give a look over here the image tag the image uh, coding is like that where href and your path of the image and uh, that, that is the way where which you can automatically your XML file can call all the images in appropriate positions and that is the main thing of your auto pagination one more thing is uh, here that is a uh, tag mapping so just come into this uh, just close the XML in your template and tag mapping is uh, just uh, when you map any tag just just go to the tags and style so you can uh, map the tag with your InDesign style. So uh, <clears throat> I'm just open your uh, XML file in your uh, InDesign. So the, finally, when you import your XML file in your InDesign, just select the XML file and open, open. See, the automatically of entire pagination has been done. It, it automatically. So. Uh, your 80% uh, work uh, load has been uh, finished over here so you just uh, see the pagination the base alignment or uh, any other pagination rules you have to follow that up to that so mainly the placement of your styles and elements and uh, images are, has been done so I am showing one more thing the mapping over here just see go to the this area and tag mapping to style and just abstract here is this map of extract. You go against extract. Uh, give this uh, 
uh, style of abstract over here. Full quote. So it automatically get tagged. You can see it automatically get tagged. So this is what the automations uh, I'm telling you and try it yourself and I think it is very easy thank you very much uh, to watch this video and uh, in next uh, video tutorial I will uh, bring an um, important thing for you a very interesting thing that is how to create a mobile app or Android app or a <coughs> iPad app from your print publications and um, keep your fixed layout divisions and uh, with some two plugins it's there I will use those are uh, Adobe uh, DPS and Adobe Folio Folio Builders so for now thanks so much for watching for this video bye bye